Hi, my name is Amanda Goodman, product consultant here at DCOM. We're going to walk through how DCOM automatically will generate the required documents or labels that a customer is requesting when product is shipped to them. What we want to eliminate is anybody having to remember when I have a requirement for customer A versus customer B, what labels or what documents do I need to generate when I'm shipping product to them. DCOM is going to identify through document groups what documents are going to get generated and the template of those documents. So first we can see, based on our part forms list, the ability to design specific templates of documents. For example, I have a standard certificate of analysis here. I could have a template that's a French C of A or Spanish C of A. There's no limitation to the design of these forms or the number of templates that would be required for a manufacturer or distributor to generate. Then we have what's called document groups. And document groups is identifying, based on the document group type, what documents and templates of those documents are going to get generated at the time of shipment. So when we take a look at this particular document group, we're identifying that we need a bill of lading, a certificate of analysis, a packing list, and a certificate of origin. And again, we don't want to have to ever manually create these documents or remember what documents are required to be generated when we're shipping to a specific location. At the bill to and ship to record, we are linking the specific document type to that record. So again, the system automatically will generate those and remembers what templates need to be generated at the time of shipment. As we go into the shipping process then, and we specify what lots are gonna be shipped, any quality information or customer information will automatically get generated based on the lots that we're shipping against that specific order. When we ship that order, those documents then will automatically generate. Here being the certificate of analysis, which is identifying all the tests that were performed with the results of those tests, the certificate of origin, the packing slip, and the bill of lading.